Please, Kamina, don't do this. Take him to the brig. How long until the pirates are back in range? Hour, maybe two, depending on burn. Same as last time. The time before that? And the tin time before that. How are you doing? I'm not the one we need to worry about. Her body can't heal under this burn. Even Khan needs to rest sometime. You'll figure something out. I know you will. Motherfuckers! Shouldn't be possible! ETA, eight minutes! They must have increased their burn this time. Uh, don't these Pashangwalas rest? Humans rest. Pirates? Are fucking animals. We need to do something about your arm. Virgil has the medbay prepped and ready. It's fine. Hardly hurts anymore. We're outgunned and nearly out of fuel. Unless we come up with a plan to shake them soon, infection's gonna be the least of my problems. What do you think we should do? What do I think we should do? Besides find ourselves a captain who knows how to make decisions? I was asking your opinion. My opinion is that there is no good option. Whatever you choose will be wrong. And it's your fucking job to choose, Captain. Coordinates, 8214. What are we looking at? Fuck if I know. It's a ship's graveyard. Debris field. Caught in orbit around that body. There's nothing registered there. How do you know? Back when I was MCRN, there were reports of a proxy battle right around here with UNN forces. Never confirmed, but seemed legit. Or much more likely, it's some solar backscatter, radiation cluttering, or any other fucking thing. How large was this battle? Large enough for a pissant ensign like me to hear about it. I'd guess nearly a dozen ships? New plan! We run for cover, in there! Won't work, boss man! If we, if we break their lock, they'll be able to track our drive plume! There won't be a drive plume. We burn hard for here first, then cut engine and turn into orbit. Let it carry us around until we land in the debris. Slingshot, fuck yes! Could work, if there is actually something there. Stations! Con! On my word, loose a PDC volley, then turn and burn.
landed in the debris field. It's shit pirates! You did it, Barsmang! Fucking legend! <laughs> Quiet! We don't have much time. The pirates are searching for us and we can't run again without more fuel and reaction mass. Arlen? Baratna and I will head out and start scanning. Captain, I'm prepped for surgery as soon as Khan is ready. <sighs> Tell that waste of oxygen I wouldn't be needing surgery if he didn't freak out the first time. I'm still here. Virgil won't let you down. He handled Rayan's surgery just fine. The prosthetic is ready. Is the, uh, patient? Fine. But you're staying to make sure Dr. Dipshit doesn't cut off the wrong arm. Scanners, I'm picking up any signs of fuel. Keep looking. Meantime, I'll go for their reaction mass. What a mess. What got Earth and Mars so worked up? And what's a Delta ship doing in the middle of it? Who knows? Hopefully they all got some reaction mass on board though. I'll never look at a containment vault the same again after that terrible situation with Rayon. Rayon, how's the new prosthetic doing? Sometimes it feels just like my old leg. But then sometimes it feels like it's the stranger who won't let go of me. And then it starts itching so bad. Quit whining. You made the red call, Cap. Ray wasn't using his leg much anyway. <laughs> Found some reaction mass. Toss it to me. I will store it. Nice toss, Cap! Woo! Boss man, you probably noticed me Baratna has been a little edgy lately. Ray, your brother has been an angry Pasheng Walla since my first day on board. This is different. He's... He's got the shakes. It's the pixie dust. But he's been clean for almost a year! He takes some meds that help keep him straight, but... But we haven't done a supply run in weeks. Yeah. Ran out of toxiperidone three days ago. Don't worry, boss man. He'll be fine. He tough. But... Thought you should know.
Were they planning for an interrogation? Then why'd they start shooting? Hmm. The Martian ship had focus drugs on board. Must have wanted to question someone. I hate those things. Rayon and I got busted by the MCR in once. Didn't think I'd leave that interrogation room alive. Watching that Martian's eyes go all weird. Last time we ever stole anything on Vesta. Had to move to Ceres and start stealing there. Virgil will probably appreciate these mushrooms. Oh, maybe he'll make white kibble when we get back. Cap, what do you think of Virgil? You trust him? Virgil's a smart man. And a reliable medic. Until he got our pilot shot, you mean? Some people don't have anything real to care about. Typical Inyas. Travel all the way out here, yet can't break free from their peppy plant extract. Might be able to rewire this guidance system to work with our ammo. It was good enough for Earth and Mars to tear each other apart. And neither side surrendered, even after taking heavy fire. Stupid Inyas, they never know when to quit. Maya is always complaining about the tools in the engineering bay. Maybe an MCRM model would cheer her up. Yeah, Cap. Cheer up the Martian girl with your tool. Pashang Fong. I'm sure Khan will be fine, but it wouldn't hurt to check on the crew. Don't want to interrupt, but how is everything down there? The auto dock kept us on track, but Virgil had to do some of the larger incisions himself. Khan will be out for a while. When she wakes up, we'll try to attach the prosthetic and... What the... Oye, Maya. Shit.
Can't surgery goes well. For her sake and Virgil's. Maya? Status report? Fire the torpedoes! Give those sons of bitches a welcome, or I'll throw you on the brig! Sit down, or I'll cut off the other arm! Sorry, Cap, what was that? Wait, are the pirates attacking? No! Kana's just a little woozy from the anesthesia. Don't worry about a thing. I'm gonna knock her out if she gets up again. Got some juice here. We're running low after the past week. Any longer in the crash couch and I'll stop pissing that stuff. Ugh. And Inya say that Belta food is disgusting. Real Earth Whiskey. Even Cox has to settle for the Belta stuff. Cox, I need you to tell me everything you know about this Toussaint and the Europa's Bing. They're pirates, what's to tell? Helpful as always. I'll leave you to enjoy the brig. Yeah, wait, wait. Is Kana... I mean... How is she? She'll live. No thanks to you. Or that hothead Virgil. He's the one who lunged in and made the gun go off. Which was in response to you provoking him. You seem to say that he was hiding something from us. Maybe. Let me out of here and we can talk about it. Mmm, no. Earthers love their oceans. Too bad they destroyed them all. Maya seemed willing to help with Khan's surgery. Hope she doesn't regret that now. Is everything, um... Okay, she just said we've been boarded. And now she's wandering around looking for intruders. So, everything's fine. Maya? Are you afraid of the elderly woman with one arm? Fuck off! You weren't here! You didn't see the look in her eyes when she... Hey there! Do you want to lie down for a minute? Do you want to fucking die?! Oh no. Got a barrel here. 
I'll take that. Good work, Sasata. Boss man, head over to the Belta ship. It's locked down, but I think I can blast us inside. Got it. Hopefully we'll find enough reaction mass to get out of here. And then what? We going treasure hunting? Yeah. You think those coordinates go anywhere interesting? Cox said those coordinates were valuable. But Cox started talking just to get out of the mess he made. You been near a brig lately? Since you save his ass, Owala never shuts up. Must be the captain. Very proud of his connections to the UN and Brass. These boots might fit Khan. Once I get the feet out of them. Oh. Yeah, feet are a good sign. Means they work. Explosives are set. Good work, Kamina. Now let the whole station see what happens to traitors who sell out the OPA to the Inyas. I'm in. Another blast door. Pshing. Fine, I'll get more explosives. No need. I should be able to access the lockdown controls from the bridge. Good thinking, Cap. Could still find more explosives. Just in case. Yalek Pashang! If there's one thing all belters can agree on, is that the moldy filters kick ass. Maya and Khan start fighting, there won't be any ship left to go back to. Please tell me you're still alive. Okay. Khan and I had to trade a few punches, but we got her calm enough to attach the prosthetic. Aw, were you worried about me? Of course I was. The next time you go up against Khan, at least bring a torpedo. Hey, I did okay without the heavy weaponry. 
Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to find an ice pack. That went surprisingly well. They were heading toward Titania to link up with the Belta sect there. Almost made it. Looks like the crew tried to record a message. This message is to all Erta and Martian security forces in the area. We have received your warnings and demands, and this will be our only response. The MCRN says we have stolen their property. The UNN says we are traveling illegally in their sector. We recognize neither of your claims over us. This is our belt. Torpedoes, away! Incoming! Wouldn't let anyone get their hands on that tech. Good for them. I'll need to make a hole to pass this to the twins. Found another barrel. Woo! This is loaded! Or whatever the Inya say. <laughs> Touchdown! Woo! We've got some radiation from a nearby ship, the Manitoba. Scanner shows the engine is mostly intact. Maybe a few pellets too. Boss man, that's the far edge of the debris field. You'll be exposed. You two head back to the Artemis. Everyone stays on the ship, but be ready to pick me up on my order. Sabaka, they locked us? No, it's a broadcast. But they must know we're close. Patch it over. There is no sense in running anymore. You know who I am, and I am looking forward to meeting you. Contact me to discuss the terms of your surrender. Or just sit and wait until we find you. It's only a matter of time. Shit, shit, shit! Cap, you got to get back here! 
Not without fuel pellets. Stupid drone is stuck. Sabaka? I doubt they will all be so easy to kill. Virgil, if I respond, will they be able to trace the signal? No, it will only confirm you are in broadcast range. But they seem pretty sure of that already. Put me through. Captain Zapata, this is Kamina Drummer of the Artemis. I don't want to fight you, but keep sending your crew after me, and I'll be forced to keep killing them. A long way from Siri Station, Kamina Drummer. You've heard of me? I've heard of your work and your bounty. But if I'm speaking to you, what happened to Garrison Cox? He attempted to double his profits. As a result, I am now captain. Not surprising. There's no loyalty among scavengers. Not that the OPA is any better. You must really enjoy the company of miscreants. Yuri Motek, first gunner. Lucky he missed me.
you can always retreat to Song. Protect the rest of your crew. 